I think at the end of the day, what we learned in college a lot of times in school is we learned to build business plans. And in, in the real environment, we don't typically use business plans for much anymore. We build marketing presentations because we're raising money and we talk to investors. But we build financial models based on actual data that we, we get together, we do research. But in terms of structuring things in, in traditional forms, it's not really that relevant. It's much more, here's my idea, what's the size of the market, what are the unit economics? Because who is here sir, heard it's a multi-billion dollar market, all I need to do is get 2%. Never say that to an investor, by the way. Yeah, uh, because because the, the kind of like NDAs. The the better way to think about it is what are the unit economics of selling one, and how much will it cost me to produce, or what is my marketing cost going to be, what's my customer acquisition cost going to be, and then how do I scale? That that's kind of the thought process. The hundred billion dollar market is right. Just never say. If we can get 2% of that market, I'll say how you're going to get 2% of that market. And that, that's the interesting caveat. Because the clear plan will outline your ability to do that. 